Hello, this is Tori with Landio. We have a new 48 plus acre property along the Little Medicine Bow River in Wyoming. This is an actual view from the property looking to the northeast. There you can see the Little Medicine Bow River. Here we're looking to the northwest. The Little Medicine Bow River continues. And then to the south, we're looking at Greasewood Creek, which actually runs through the property. And along the northern boundary, there's also some ancient teepee rings. This is the property highlighted in green. It's 48.63 acres. There's road access to the property. This is Greasewood Creek that runs through the southern portion of the property. And the northern portion borders 235 plus acres of riverfront commons that has the Little Medicine Bow River flowing through it. And over to the west, there's road access down to this riverfront commons area. And if you look closely in the satellite image, you can see those ancient teepee rings. This is a contour map of the parcel highlighted in green. You can see the peak elevations around 6,760 feet feet. There's a gentle slope to the south where you then find Greasewood Creek and there's a steeper slope to the north and this is where it borders at 235 plus acres of riverfront commons and there's the Little Medicine Bow River. You can see the topographic map is consistent with the contour map. There's Greasewood Creek running through the property. Here you have the higher elevation point, nice level building area with amazing views and then there's the riverfront commons area with the Little Medicine Bow River. To the east you have about 162 acres of BLM land. If we zoom out a little bit further you can see see all that riverfront commons area. Now this riverfront commons you can enjoy hiking, fishing, camping, horseback riding. Fish in the Little Medicine Bow River include brown, rainbow, and brook trout. There's also an abundance of wildlife in the area including pronghorn antelope. This area Wyoming is considered the pronghorn capital of the United States. Here's some wildlife droppings on the property. This is the Wyoming Game and Fish Department website. They have a lot of great information. Here we have the hunting unit maps for antelope, deer, elk, mountain lion, pheasant, and sage grouse. I'll show you where this property is located. This is the 48.63 acres right here. To the south, about 18 minutes from the property, you have the town of Medicine Bow, which has a population around 270. There is a post office in Medicine Bow. You're about 40 minutes from Hannah, Wyoming, to the west. Hannah has a population around 800. There you'll find grocery store, building supplies, fuel, and public schools. You're about equidistant from Rollins, Wyoming, to the west, about an hour and 15 minutes to the west, and then Laramie, Wyoming, to the southeast. Laramie has a population around 30,000. Rollins, a population around 10,000. In both of these cities, you'll be able to find hospitals, Walmart super centers, shopping, dining, professional services. About an hour and 20 minutes to the Medicine Bow National Forest. There's over a million acres of national forest land down here in the Medicine Bow National Forest. And you're about 40 miles from Interstate 80. This property has great drive up access. We'll look at the directions from Medicine Bow to the property. Here's a welcome sign for the town of Medicine Bow. The paved state highway 487 en route to the property crossing over the Medicine Bow River. There's the town of Medicine Bow. There's the Medicine Bow River. This is where 487 intersects with County Road 262, which is also called Nine Mile Road. And from this intersection, it's 7.8 miles to the property. This is driving along Nine Mile Road, County Road 262. En route to the property, you can see the electricity lines and poles. This is County Road 262. And this is only half a mile south of the property. This is where you'll turn north onto Meadowlark Road. Here you can see the electricity lines and poles along County Road 262. Again, this is only a mile south of the property. Here we have the route drawn out. Again, it's one mile from this intersection, County Road 262 and Meadowlark Road to the property. And this is that intersection. You can see the street sign for Meadowlark Road. Again, showing that intersection. Now we're turning north onto Meadowlark Road. This is where it crosses over Greasewood Creek. And now we're actually on the property and this is looking south. There's Greasewood Creek. There are survey markers in place on the property. Property. Here's some wildflowers on the property, along with pronghorn antelope that the photographer captured. Here's a view to the southeast. This is looking east at Greasewood Creek, a view of Greasewood Creek from the property. This is a beautiful photo from one of the vantage points of the rock outcroppings along the northern boundary, looking over the Little Medicine Bow River. This would be looking to the northeast, and here we're looking to the northwest. This is down along the banks of the Little Medicine Bow River. This is that 235 acres of riverfront commons, and this is deeded pro rata shares to all the property owners here within the Cassidy River Ranch. If we go back to these teepee rings, which we have pointed out in several of the images, we point out these teepee rings in many of the images, and it's interesting to note that the Native Americans chose this spot for a reason. It's a great vantage point that you can see 360 degree views all around of what's going on. You have the resources of fishing and, and the fresh water at the Little Medicine Bow River, abundance of wildlife, which would also be a attracted to the live water, both through Greasewood Creek and the Little Medicine Bow River. And this is a really unique attribute that we have never seen before on one of our properties. And look at these beautiful sunsets you'll enjoy from the property, it's truly breathtaking. These are Google Earth terrain views. This is south of the property looking north. There's Greasewood Creek running through the property. Now we're east of the property looking west, another great view of Greasewood Creek. 
Here you have the 235 acres of Riverfront Commons along with the Little Medicine Bow River. Now we're northeast looking southwest. There are the TP rings. And again, that 235 plus acres of Riverfront Commons. There's the road access to the property. Now we're north of the property looking south. And now we're west of the property looking east. Again, you can see all that Riverfront Commons access and the Little Medicine Bow River. Here we have the white circles representing nearby landowners that have developed their properties to varying degrees. You can use the property recreationally, seasonally, or live there full time. There is no minimum dwelling size. And you can also do alternative types of structures like a shipping container home, an arch cabin, tiny home, mobile home, manufactured home, geodesic dome, an earth ship, straw bale house, barn dominium. As we mentioned previously, you're only 18 minutes from the town of Medicine Bow, about 39 minutes from Hannah, Wyoming. Hannah has a population around 800. There's a grocery store, hardware and building supplies, about an hour and 14 minutes from Rollins, Wyoming to the west, which has a population around 10,000. Here's downtown Rollins. There's also a Walmart super center in Rollins and a hospital. And then to the southeast, you're about an hour and 15 minutes from Laramie, Wyoming. Laramie has a population around 30,000. There's also a hospital, Walmart Supercenter, the University of Wyoming, and a regional airport. This is downtown Laramie where you'll find shopping, dining, professional services. About an hour and 20 minutes from the Medicine Bow National Forest. Here are some photos of the Medicine Bow National Forest. Incredibly beautiful area. Over a million plus acres of national forest land there. To the northwest and west of the property, you have an abundance of boating, water sports, fishing, and outdoor recreational opportunities all along the North Platte River, which has been dammed up to create create the Alcoba Reservoir, the Pathfinder Reservoir, and the Seminole Reservoir. And along this area here is the Miracle Mile, which offers world-class fly fishing. We'll show you some photos of these locations. This is the Alcoba Reservoir. Here you have the Miracle Mile along the North Platte River. Another photo of the North Platte River. This is Fremont Canyon that runs along the North Platte River. This is north of the Miracle Mile. You can see people out there fly fishing, incredibly picturesque. About an hour and 40 minutes from Casper, Wyoming. Casper has a population around 60,000. It's the second largest city in Wyoming. There's the North Platte River running through Casper. We're a little over two hours from Cheyenne, Wyoming. Cheyenne is the largest city in Wyoming. Has a population over 90,000. Here's downtown Cheyenne, Wyoming. This is the Seminole Dam and the Seminole Reservoir. And here we have the Pathfinder Reservoir. And this is all within about an hour and a half to two hours from the property. To the south, you're about two hours and 30 minutes from Fort Collins, Colorado. It's has a population around 152,000. And you're about three and a half hours from Denver, population over a million. There's also an international airport in Denver. So if you were to fly out to the property, you most likely fly to Denver, where you'll find direct flights from almost anywhere in the United States and even outside of the United States. And then from there, it's only about a three and a half hour drive to the property. And then to the Northwest, you're a little more than five hours from the Grand Teton National Park and about six and a half hours from the famed Yellowstone National Park. We have this 48.63 acre property along the Little Medicine Bow River in that 235 acres of riverfront commons in Wyoming, priced only 69.9. All the property details are listed here on our website. The property taxes are only $196 a year. There's just a $100 a year assessment for the Cassidy River Ranch Property Owners Association. We have a detailed property description with lots of great information and links to additional resources. I recommend you take the time to read through this description. Down here we have information on the nearby points of interest with links where you can find more information about those locations. Here are the GPS coordinates with links where you can open those on a Google map. There's over 150 images of the property and the surrounding area, including maps. All of these images have captions. There's lots of labels, so you can clearly know what it is you're looking at. And the photos of the property are of the actual property. And then at the bottom of the page, we have this interactive map. If you'd like to view the interactive map on a larger screen, you can just click View Full Screen right here. Or within the property description, you can click View Map on the interactive map right here. That'll open it up in a new window. This is the 48 acre parcel. What we did is we mapped out the 235 acres of Riverfront Commons with this blue shaded area. If you wanted to turn that off, you can go over here to the map legend, click map features, and then Riverfront Commons, you can turn that off. If you wanted to zoom in, you could actually see the path of the Little Medicine Bow River. And you wanted to turn that back on, you can do so right there. And if you wanted to see the road to the property, you can turn that layer on right there. And it'll show you the road to the property from County Road 262. This is an incredibly beautiful property with lots of unique attributes that are rare to find all together in one property. Wyoming is a beautiful state. It is the least populated state in the entire United States out of all 50 states. Another thing that people like is that there's no state income tax in Wyoming. If this property fits what you're looking for, we highly recommend you go to our website and click on this buy now button. We only have one of each property available and we sell our properties on a first come first serve basis. So the first person that places a deposit secures the purchase of the property. Once you've added the deposit to your cart then just click checkout. This window will appear where you'll enter then all your contact information, click continue to payment, 
enter your payment information, and then complete the checkout process. As soon as that checkout process has been completed, this Buy Now button will automatically change to Out of Stock. Again, we only have one of each property available. So only one person can place a deposit on a property, and we work extremely hard to make it super easy for you to purchase land. That $499 deposit is credited towards your purchase, and then we cover all the closing costs. The remaining balance may be paid by wire transfer, cashier's check, ACH, bank draft, credit card, debit card, or any combination of these methods. There are no other commissions or fees, so your total purchase purchase price for this property is just the $69.9. And then again, that $4.99 deposit is credited towards that amount. Make the whole process super simple and it can be completed as little as a day. If you have any questions, our phone number is on the top of every page of our website. That number is 713-597-7670. That number also receives text messages. We have a live chat feature here on our website where you can communicate with us in real time. If we're not available for whatever reason, please send us a message or respond to your order next availability. You can also fill out this contact form here on our website or send us an email directly. Our email address is hello at landio.com. If you've been visiting our website and looking at our properties for a while now, we want to thank you for your continued support. If this is your first time viewing one of our properties, we want to welcome you. And if you have any questions about doing business with us, we highly recommend you go over here to our testimonials page. And here you'll find video testimonials from some of our customers in their own words. This is just a handful of our hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of happy customers all throughout the United States and even some outside the United States and take a few minutes to see what our customers have to say about their experience of doing business with us. As Stephen here simply stated, it all seemed too good to be true. It just seemed too easy. That was his thought before he completed the purchase of his property. And after that process was completed, he realized that it is true. It is real. He owns it. It's amazing. It's beautiful. And he even goes into detail about his experience purchasing the property from us and then going to visit the property at a later date. And it would truly be an honor to add you to the Landio family of happy customers and you felt so compelled by the service you received that you provide the testimonial as well. We sincerely appreciate your continued support. Thank you and God bless. Landio. Land is opportunity. Please click in the upper left hand corner and subscribe to our YouTube channel. In the upper right hand corner we have all of our available properties in a playlist. In the lower right hand corner we have a playlist of our Land is Opportunity series. And in the lower left hand corner we have our Landio Unscripted series.